What's up, YouTube? It's E to the Boss. Is it what I have for you guys? Is a double nuclear meltdown using the MP7? I was playing with my boy Hard Hat, and I was playing with Omni Teller Black. And what's funny is Hard Hat actually lagged out, but you know that ain't deterred me. You know, I still did my thing. And uh, yeah, I dropped that double nuclear. A lot of y'all was like, E to you can't even play Black Ops, but you can't even drop a nuclear. Not only did I drop a nuclear, I proved y'all niggas wrong and dropped a double. So get at me, boy. Get at me, boy. You don't know about me. Y'all tried to. Jock my swag, I had to take that back. Ooh, bars. Not even trying off the dome. Let me calm down real quick, though. But, um, if you guys might notice, there's something a little different about my commentary quality. I just got my new mic today. I got me a blue snowball with the pop filter. So my commentary should be a lot better. Much clearer, much clearer. It's just gonna be a new level shit right now. You know, it's level to this shit, young boy, and I'm on that level. And if you subscribe to me, you're on that level, too. So we all on the same low. So you know everything is Gucci over here. It's Gucci and the ET the boss squad. We rolling up all niggas. We about to mob all niggas and shit. You know we doing us. Like we supposed to. I think that's what I'm going to start calling now. Either. Tell me what you guys think in the comments. ET the boss squad or ET the boss mob. I, dang I like both. The boss mob or the boss squad. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think we should call ourselves from now on, you know, because I'm getting close to 500 subs. I think I need a name for all my homeboys, all my niggas coming up through the struggle with me. And I think it would be interesting to see what you guys think. So leave in the comments what, you know, we should call ourselves. Each of the boss mob, each of the boss squad, or whatever you think. And, you know, if someone puts something down good in the comments, I'll probably use that. But what I want to talk about, though, is Moabs and Kims versus VSATs. I mean, not VSATs, Nucleus, my bad. Um, which one's easier and which one's harder? Personally, I think the nuclear is easier because of the VSAT, but it's a lot of stuff that can prevent you from getting the nuclear because in Black Ops 2, there are EMP grenades, which even with tack masks lasts for a long time. Um, shock charges, niggas running target finder LMG, bad hit detection, bad connection. It's a lot of stuff that can prevent you from getting a nuclear, but in Ghost and Nuclear 3, you don't have um you don't have the VSAT, but you do have ballistic vest if you run support. And that really helps a lot actually. So and it's uh it's four it's four to five kills lower. Cause even with hardline, you're not gonna get your nuclear 29 kills. It's exactly 30 kills. It doesn't matter if you're wearing hardline. So with hardline and um with hardline and ghost and MW3. You can get your you can get your uh, more with Kim one kill sooner, and the assist counts as kills. So with that combination, the ballistic vest and the heart line, you know, making it a kill shorter, you know, it it, it kind of comes at a tie in my opinion. I think it's a tie. Even though I did say nuclears are easier, I take that back. Now I think about it, it's a tie because if you have people running support for you. You could easily drop a Kim or more because they got ballistic vests and they got all this um UAVs and advanced UAVs and all that kind of stuff. But even in Black Ops 2, if you have people running support, it's just a stream of VSATs just non-stop. So it just depends. But um yeah, I think it's a tie in my opinion. Tell me what you guys think. Do you think it's a tie between nuclears and Kims and Moabs or nah? Like, I know some people they say they think nuclears are harder. I personally don't. Mainly because of the VSAT and you can throw up counter UAVs or EMPs and they won't know you are all match. But at the same time, I can see why they can say they're harder because like I said earlier, it is a 30 kill, you know, it is a 30 kill achievement. Whereas the Kim is just a 25-24 kill, Morb is just 25-24 kill. But it's a whole lot of shit that comes into play. So that's why I say it's, it's just going to draw even. So tell me what you guys think though. I also want to let you guys know. Then my 500 subs wrap has been completed. I just finished it today. I was using my blue snowball because, you know, it improved my sound quality for my last rap. So it's definitely going to sound better. And I think I did a good job. Um, I let some people listen to it and they say they enjoyed it. So we'll just see what you guys think. I think you will enjoy it, though. And, you know, it's just a little appreciation for getting me to 500 subs. And we're real close, real fucking close. So... Once we get there, you know, everything's going to be smooth. I'm also working on an OG Bobby Johnson rap. Um, this dude named Rush Agility asked me to do one in my last video. So if you're watching this right now, just know I got you. I got you.
So, um, you know, if you guys want me to do anything specific, like raps or stuff like that, I can actually do them now since I got the blue snowball. It greatly improves my voice quality. So, you know, those will definitely be better. I think I might start using it on my vlogs too, but what I do is I like try and keep it out the camera frame or something. I don't know, we'll see. But, you know, from here on, it's just improvements. Everything's, everything's getting good, man. Everything's just going well. But like I said earlier, let me know if you guys want to be called Ichi the Boss Squad, Ichi the Boss Mob. I don't know, Ichi the Boss Nation. Now, never mind. Why SMB does that shit? And I ain't trying to do that shit. Um, take that how you want. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm going to just leave it at that. I'm Ichi the Boss. I'm out. Leave a like, subscribe if you haven't. I ain't never going to force you. I ain't never going to start forcing you. Because I'm not that type of dude. Y'all probably whoop my ass on some real shit. So, I ain't going to try and threaten nobody. There's probably some 300 pound, 7 foot nigga watching this. He'll just come up to my house and whoop the shit out of me. I don't want that. I don't want that shit to happen. You don't know what can happen. But I'm out. Peace. G -G -G